Welcome to flarebartending.tv. My name is Chris and we're going to jump right into a really good basic beginning working flare move here. It's called the back of the hand cradle and it looks just like this. There we have it, alright? The back of the hand cradle. Let me do it for you one more time. That is the move. It's nothing crazy showy, but it's a really good basic uh, beginning move that you should, be, you should be able to get with just a little bit of practice at home and then be able to go and do this at work with a full bottle and be able to entertain your guests a little bit. I'm going to set down the glass bottle and pick up my practice bottle here and show you there's really two parts to the move. There's the throw, uh, which is really just throwing it real gently across your body. For starters, you want to um, grab the bottle by the body. When you look at the bottle, we've got three different parts to the bottle. We've got the body, we've got the shoulders, and we've got the neck. When you're pulling a bottle out of the rail and you go to make a drink, you're usually pulling it up by the neck. So if that's uh, how you're grabbing this one to start, go ahead and pull it up a little bit and then grab it by the body. It's just a little bit easier to control the angle of this body as we're doing that. So we got a hold of it there. We're just going to give a nice gentle toss across the body. Like I said, we want to go ahead and just let it fall a little bit uh, like so. We don't want it to be spilling end over end and we don't want it to be straight up and down. Practice getting this just a nice gentle fall like so. That's the throw. The second part is the cradle. We're going to put our two hands out together, palms face down, and we're not going to keep them flat like this because if we do that, the bottle is going to land on it and either fall over or it's going to land and start spilling at the side. And spilling is never allowed while you're at work. Practicing, that's fine, but we want to make sure we can do all these moves without ever spilling a drop at work. So we've got our two hands, palms together. We're going to put them at a slight, probably 30 to 45 degree angle so we can catch that bottle. Cradle it, just kind of give a little bit, and then go ahead and pop it right back. So we've practiced that, we've gotten the throw, we put them together, and the move looks just like this. There we have it. Also notice too that I am kind of, if my hands come apart a little bit, one of them is go ahead and, and landing on the body itself, the other one helps support the neck. So if we do that, you might find that a little bit easier to keep it from if it's falling over your hands, uh, what have you. This just kind of helps really keep the angle of that bottle better. Uh, one last final note on practicing this, uh, especially as you're starting flare bartending here, you're getting comfortable with some of the moves. Uh, as much as it might drive you nuts, try and be as ambidextrous as possible. I'm right-handed, um, probably most of you are right-handed, so we're going to start, mo usually most of us will be more comfortable throwing with the right hand as opposed to catching uh, with the right hand. But we want to go ahead and make sure that as we're practicing and getting comfortable with that move, that we also go ahead and practice from the other side here. And I'll be the first to admit um, I'm guilty that I don't practice as much with my left hand. But if you do this while you're starting, you will find yourself so much uh, better prepared to be able to go into a number of different moves that if you're comfortable doing it with your right hand, and if you can also get yourself com comfortable doing it with your left hand, you're just going to be so much uh, better prepared to do that kind of stuff. So that is the move one more time for you. I'm also going to grab and practice it this time with an almost full bottle. I just got water in here for practicing to prove to you that this is a move that we can do. We can take off the, pour or take off the, um, the cap, put a pour spot on at work, go ahead and give this a shot. That is the back of the hand cradle. Practice, practice, and good luck.